I don't know who needs this Bible verse, but you know if it's for you today. I want to talk to you about Matthew chapter 24 verse 12, which says, Because of the increase of wickedness, the love of most will grow cold. This is a powerful verse that speaks to the state of the world in the end times, but what exactly does it mean? The word wickedness in this verse refers to evil, sin, and lawlessness. As the world gets closer to the end, we can expect to see an increase in all of these things. The word love in this verse refers to a number of things, including love for God, love for neighbor, love for truth, love for justice. As wickedness increases, the love of most will grow cold in all of these areas. There are a few things to think about when we consider this verse. First, we should be aware of the signs of the times. As we see wickedness increasing, we should be prepared for the fact that the love of many will grow cold. Second, we should make sure that our own love is growing stronger, not colder. We can do this by spending time in prayer and Bible study and by serving others in love. Third, we should remember that Jesus is coming back. He has promised to rescue his people from the wickedness of this world. Here are a few references that you can use. Matthew chapter 24, verse 12, which says, And because lawlessness will abound, the love of many will grow cold. 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 1 to 5, which says, But know this, that in the last days perilous times will come, for men will be lovers of themselves, lovers of money, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, unloving, unforgiving, slanderers, without self-control, brutal, despisers of good, traitors, headstrong, haughty, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God, having a form of godliness but denying its power. And from such people turn away. First John chapter 4 verse 7 to 8 which says, Beloved, let us love one another for love is of God, and everyone who loves is born of God and knows God. He who does not love does not know God, for God is love. Revelation chapter 2 verse 4 to 5 which says, Nevertheless I have this against you, that you have left your first love. Remember therefore from where you have fallen, repent and do the first works, or else I will come to you quickly and remove your lampstand from its place, unless you repent. Let's pray together, Lord Jesus. Help me to keep my love for you strong, even when the world around me is full of lawlessness and sin. Help me to be a faithful witness for you, even when it is difficult. Thank you for your love and for your promise to return one day. In Jesus' name, amen. Matthew chapter 24 verse 12 is a warning about the state of the world in the end times. It is also a call for us to keep our own love growing stronger, not colder. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. May God bless you with abundance and keep you always. Please comment, Amen. Thanks for watching to the end. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Also turn on the notification bell to get notified. When we upload a video, remain blessed and see you in our next video.